1000 LB Sisters Season 4, How is Tammy doing after her health scare? For more update please subscribe United News 24 YouTube channel and press the bell button. A fresh 1000 LB Sisters update is available to share. Tammy Slayton seems to have found love again, Tammy apparently did manage to drop weight while in rehab, but she also lost a lot more than that. She reconciled with Philip Redmond, her ex-boyfriend, but it appears that they have broken up once more. In a TikTok she made this week, the TLC personality revealed the news. The BBW king on the show, Philip Redmond, was not well liked by Tammy's family. Her family believed that he only treated Tammy like a fetish and had no regard for her well-being. When they parted ways, the family felt relieved. While she was in recovery, it appears that they reignited their previous romance, fans undoubtedly want information regarding the divorce, but Tammy doesn't seem eager to provide much of it. She did state that the choice was personal and that it was simply unsuccessful, when crap happens, you move on. I'm not going back this time, the TLC star confessed on TikTok. In addition to Philip Redman, Tammy Slayton had a love relationship with Mikey Mooney before they reconciled. Furthermore, it's not entirely apparent what transpired in this relationship. In any case, it seems like he is also absent from the scene. Hopefully, Season 4 of 1000 LB Sisters will provide more detailed explanations about Tammy's love life. While Tammy works on herself, many people want her to remain unmarried. They think she advances so much on her own and then regresses whenever she starts dating someone, fans are still impatiently awaiting the next 1000 LB Sisters update from TLC. There would be plenty of plots because Tammy and Amy have both been very busy. So what is happening, according to TV Showcase, some believe that season 4 has already begun filming and that TLC will reveal it soon. Viewers may certainly anticipate seeing Tammy's stint in treatment and Tammy's operation if season 4 is ever broadcast on TLC. Tammy had bariatric surgery at the end of July, as was well documented. She allegedly made tremendous progress in rehabilitation and was approved for the treatment, according to insiders. The show might also delve into Tammy's romantic life. It's probable that Philip Redmond will also make another appearance on the show because he frequently appears in and out of her life. Would you like to follow the sisters' progress? For the next 1000 LB Sisters upgrade, keep checking back. Hopefully, information about season 4 will be available soon. Remain tuned. In a TikTok video she posted from her Ohio based treatment center in February 2022, Tammy pleasantly surprised her fans with a rare life update. She hinted in the clip that she was doing well with her weight loss, but viewers will have to wait until the start of the next season of the show before learning more about her. I'd love to give you an update on my weight loss, but you'll have to wait until season 4 is released, she added. Sorry. Just know that I'm remaining on track and things are looking good, Tammy added as a subtle hint. Nearly seven months have passed since Tammy's harrowing hospitalization for carbon monoxide poisoning in November 2021, during which she received a tracheostomy and was placed on life support. Months after her brother Chris Combs disclosed that Tammy lost 115 pounds in just 30 days while in rehab, she is still using her trach tube. In recent months, Tammy has kept a low profile and avoided using social media. Fans were worried about Tammy's health but Amy emphasized that there was no connection between her sister's social media absence and Tammy's well-being. She had to create new accounts after being shut out of her old ones. She informed her followers on Instagram in April that TikTok had blacklisted her, and in January 2022, Amy and Michael made the news that they were expecting their second child. In November 2020, the couple welcomed Gage, their first child. Amy regularly shared maternity updates on social media during her second pregnancy, she moved from Dixon, Kentucky, to Morganfield on April 18, and her Instagram post with the caption 27 weeks baby was the result. Uh, on July 5, Amy gave birth to her second child, a male they called Glenn Allen. She added the caption welcome Glenn Allen Halterman on a picture of her and Michael holding the newborn at the hospital, finally, the wait is over. Following the birth, she told people, Michael and I are excited to announce the arrival of our son, Glenn Allen Halterman. 
We now have both of our miraculous boys, and the delivery was a wonderful success. Thanks for watching this video and please subscribe our United News 24 YouTube channel for more update news.